students i hope you all are fit and fine and doing well in studies so stay at home and stay safe so today in this video we are going to start our chapter number 2 name of the chapter is our body system so let's start so you all see buildings in your surrounding and also you know that these buildings made up from many bricks so students can you tell me what is our body made up of so the answer is cells our body is made up of millions of very tiny means small living units called cell just like a buildings made up of bricks so there are different types of cell some cells are flat some cells are round in shape and some are long and thin so we can say that the cells are the building blocks of our body and these cells can only be seen under powerful microscopes next one is tissue now what is tissue cells of the same type that do the same job are grouped together to form a tissue for example muscle cells contracted and relaxed to show movement blood is a liquid tissue next is bone it is the strongest tissue in our body and enamel is the hardest tissue so the next one is organs now different kinds of tissues join together to form body's organs for example lungs liver kidneys stomach heart and brain these all are the organs and every organ has different function like heart it pumps the blood the function of the kidney is to cleanse the blood next one is organ system when a group of organs cooperate to carry out a function of the body we call it an organ system and the brain controls all the organs and systems of our body now let us see some examples of organ system like excretory system digestive system and circulatory system etc so these number of organ systems joined together and form organism like us now let's revise again what is our body made up of our body is made up of cells cells are the building block of our body so we can say that cells are the smallest functional unit of our body and when many cells join together they will form tissue many tissues join together to form organ that will further join to form organ system and then many organ system join together to form organism then there is one question arises that is it possible that an organism is made up of one cell only so its answer is yes many small organisms are made up of one cell only and they are known as microorganisms for example bacteria and amoeba these are the microorganisms